Hey everyone, welcome back to my indoor gardening channel. Today I'm going to show you a very simple, easy pest management system for all of your house plants, whether they are big or small, whether they have mealybugs, spider mites, aphids, etc. When they come into the house in the winter, this is a super easy way that I figured out to control all pests with amazing success. So all I have here is diatomaceous earth or DE for short. It's food grade, completely safe and a one quarter measuring cup filled to the top and leveled off with the DE and a one liter spray bottle. So all you need to do is funnel that into the actual spray bottle, fill it up, shake it up. And then you have a full one liter mixture of diluted diatomaceous earth ready to spray on your plants. I'm going to use this particular plant as an example. This is a beautiful gardenia tree, which I sprayed a couple of hours ago. And I'm gonna zoom in and you can see exactly the effects of spraying the diatomaceous and water mixture onto the plants. And it creates spots on it and gives 100% coverage that will basically stop any sort of pest from forming a colony on your plants. I have been doing this for a long, long time and I never have any bad insects on my plants. And as you can see, the gardenia, very picky plant is in full bloom and ready to burst. And as you can see here, this is one of my hibiscus plants. They are very prone to spider mite indoors in the winter but I've sprayed the diatomaceous earth mixture on it and it's keeping all of the insects off and you can see it's ready to burst into blooms. Right beside this, I have one of my smaller hibiscuses with big buds starting to form on it and you can see some of the white powder residue which keeps all of the bugs off and allows these very finicky plants to start to bloom and be super healthy indoors in the winter. Thanks again everyone for joining me today and learning a little bit about diatomaceous earth or DE and how it can be applied topically with water in a spray bottle. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comments. Also, please remember to subscribe and to hit the little bell to be reminded of my next video. I hope to show you many more videos this season of my beautiful collection of plants and how I grow things indoors. Thank you. Have a great day.